There's a lot more girls that skate now. They're all better than me. In 2002, my family and I went to the X Games in Philadelphia, and I had never seen girls skateboarding before. And I was like, what? I want to do that. I want to skateboard. I fell in love with skateboarding. I skated all the time. I got invited to be an alternate at the Women's Vert Contest at the X Games. It just motivated me to skate more and to work harder and to try to get in as a competitor for the following year. A few months before the X Games, the event coordinator came up to me and said, you're on the invite list, but the women's event is canceled. So I wanted to find out what was going on with women's skateboarding and how it can be changed. It's not all about the X Games. It's not that anyone wants to like push girls out of this. Yeah, I think the missing link right now is visibility. Whether it's in advertising, or it's in magazines, or it's on television, like women need to see other women skateboarding. Do you feel like you can attain that seeing another girl do it? Ideally, you're out getting coverage, and you kind of like make yourself known. If you looked at skateboard magazine, you probably still see very limited girl skateboard skateboarding in there. If you want to make a life career out of it, you've got to go to contest rap. They have struggled since, you know, not having their own events. They have struggled. We tried it. We tried the hardest to, to really make girls products for girls skateboarders and it didn't work. Girls skateboarding and girls action sports in general is huge and any company that can't see that is going to get left behind. It's boring with just, just a, a dude's club all the time. I think we're going to have to go outside the industry, make something ourselves to show how much girls skating is growing and then the industry will come to us.